What is up, you guys? It's Bolton98, and in this video, we're going to be talking about a new pay to win bundle. Yes, they couldn't stop, they did it again. The Dark Rituals 3 pack bundle, whatever you call it, is now noted as a pay to win bundle because of this red dot site here, our holographic site. Anyways, boom, here they both are. So, on the left, we have Dev Store, which is the variant, and on the right, we have the default. Here's the variant. Basically, it kind of gives this reddish tint to everyone, and I will say it's easier to see the villains, especially through the smoke. Look at how easy I saw that. This is the OG default version of it. You can kind of see it because it is yellow, but it's not as like vibrant and clear as that red one is. I feel like the red does make it pop out a little more. I don't think it's a huge advantage though as far as multiplayer goes, but then again, the Warzone and DMZ guys who pay for skins may notice this a little more. So I'm interested to see if you guys play DMZ and Warzone. Does this seem to be more pay to win than it is in multiplayer? Um, because I do notice a difference. But then we get over to our 50 years of hip hop. We finally got something from Call of Duty in game about it. Basically, we'll be getting four rewards, one gun and three war tracks. And it starts August 7th, which is when we get the Snoop Dogg skin. And it starts ends August 17th, which is when the reveal event is. So, yes, tomorrow we will be getting the Snoop Dogg. Uh, Return of the Shizzle bundle, yes, and then later on we hope to be getting Nicki Minaj as it has been confirmed that she's coming. We think she'll be around that reveal event, maybe earlier than 21 Savage who could be possibly coming out within the reveal event. But what does this mean? Because we've also found another artist called Flava Flav has a bundle basically he doesn't have a skin but he has only blueprints i think this is like a cost off blueprint and then he has a bell 46 blueprint so i don't know what this could mean could this mean we see more hip-hop artists come between this time of august 7th and august 17th such as eminem he's done stuff on ghost with their uh reveal you know trailer and stuff and he's a huge influencer in the hip-hop world or what about even the baby who we've seen make a song called Call of Duty where he talks specifically about playing Call of Duty and all types of stuff. So these are just some of the possibilities. There's tons of tons of like creative uh, suggestions you could give down below on who you think could come if you think anyone else. Or do you think the you know three that we have right here skin wise and Flava Flav's guns are all Call of Duty is probably going to add. I don't know. I just think there's a huge gap between August 7th and August 17th that's 10 days they have to fill in with some content so i'm hoping that we do get a little more but i'm not going to be surprised if we don't but of course i do believe getting snoop dogg in two variants yes he has two skins if you want to see this trailer go check out my tiktok or my shorts i posted them both on there you can get a visual of it but just let me know what you guys think i mean we get three skins a flavor flay bundle should we get more or do you think this is enough? And also, do you think this is a pay-to-win bundle? Let me know down below, guys, your thoughts and ideas, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.